You're watching Update 3 on Cyclone Pam, which has intensified since the last update. It's now a Category 4 storm on the Sapphire Simpson Hurricane wind scale, with winds of 130 miles per hour and a pressure of 937 millibars. Its current position is 11.5 degrees south, 169.7 degrees east, or perhaps a little bit further south than that at this time, at 2 p.m. UTC on March the, March the 11th. The storms are expected to move close to Vanuatu, are passing those islands, possibly as a Category 5 storm on the Sapphire Simpson Hurricane wind scale. That, of course, is winds of 160 miles per hour or higher. Um, as it stands, it's already 130, which is certainly rather significant. And uh, either way, it's going to be very strong when it passes the Vanuatu Islands. Um, and it's uh, interesting to see how close it will actually get to those islands and whether that we will indeed see a landfall or not. Cyclone warnings in effect for all of these provinces, Torba, Sanma, Panama and Malampa, um, and also Temotu province in far eastern um, Solomon Islands, excluding Santa Cruz Island at this time. Cyclone watch is in effect for the Vanuatu provinces of Shefa and Tafir. Um, that includes, of course, the capital Port Villa at this time. Those are the latest warnings. As the, at the time of this update, uh, warnings may be extending further south as the storm progresses towards that direction. Sea surface temperatures are very warm right now, around 30 degrees Celsius or thereabouts. Certainly warm enough to sustain a Category 4 or 5 cyclone. Um, so that's not going to be an issue over the next few days. Wind shear may be a slight issue, which is probably why it's not intensified quite as quickly as some people may have expected so far. High amounts of wind shear to its uh, directly to its west and northwest, lower amounts to the south and east. And looking at the latest water vapor imagery, you can see uh, the storm itself there. Um, quite a broad system as well. You can see its eye too, in relation to Cyclone Nathan on your left-hand side, um, significantly larger. Latest satellite imagery shows how the storm has been progressing over the past few hours. And you can see in the latest frames the eye really starting to appear now in those uh, in the last few frames. And the northern eye wall appears to be the strongest at this time. Um, and appears to be at least mostly complete if not uh, fully. I would hope so at this time. Um, and on the left hand side you can see the um, thunderstorms and spiral bands associated with the storm affecting um, the islands, uh, the most eastern part of um, the Solomon Islands and the northern Vanuatu Islands right now. As of March the 11th at 2pm UTC, it's a very active tropical region. Cyclone Carrie, a subtropical storm in the South Atlantic, the second one of the year. The remnants of Halibur still progressing in the South Indian Ocean. Cyclone Olwyn on the western side of Australia. Cyclone Nathan on the eastern side. And also Cyclone Pam and Tropical Depression 3W in the Western Pacific. 17 tropical storms have formed so far in 2015 worldwide. Eight of those have become Category uh, 1 hurricanes with winds of 74 miles per hour plus, and six have gone on to become Category 3 storms with winds of 115 miles per hour or higher. Um, and this, of course, was uh, number six, Pam. You can follow Force 13 on any of its outlets. The website force13.com is the main place to be for all the goings on around the world storm-wise. Of course, the uh, video page on YouTube will show you all the latest videos that are going on as well. Search Force 13. Same too for our social platforms, Facebook and Twitter, at Force 13 on Twitter. And you can also add Fool 13 on Skype for tropical weather chat and to ask for an invite uh, to join the chat room as well where we have a um, discussion with fellow storm trackers. Uh, we're also doing a live update on air at 9pm this evening on March 11th, that's UTC, so early to mid-morning um, local time in the South Pacific. And you can see the event on our social media pages and the website, the link will appear there shortly. That's all for now.